Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of my 30 Days to Die series. So it is the morning of day four. Very, very quiet, uneventful light night. Last night, nothing. No zombies, no animals, no nothing last night. Now, I'm just going to show you here real quick before we take off in the morning what I decided to keep and what I decided to throw away. Well, not really throw away, but leave behind. I left the hunting rifle with a bit of ammo just in case we do die. We can come back and at least we'll have something here. Left the leather poncho. We don't really need that. Um... Reinforced club just in case and you know the level one fire axe. We have a level two fire axe now So we'll we'll keep that on us. Don't really need the nail gun. I mean, well, should we take it? Just in case we don't find a hammer Sure, why not and we kept everything else. So let's head out We are moving relatively slowly and I think I miscalculated where we needed to be it's been a long time since my character's been in this area, so it's just kind of forgetting where I need to go. So unless we find that that one isolated trader, we're never going to be able to find the uh, we're never going to be able to find the survivor camp. So I think we have to go north east, uh, which is going to take us through the desert. So I'm hoping with the clothing we have, we're okay. Now that we have that duster and everything, I think we'll probably be okay. Um, yeah, so we're going to head off that way today. Let's not go into the minefield. And um, on the way, we're going to pick up some more yucca. Uh, we've got lots of yucca right now, yucca, um, yucca juice, and lots of bacon and eggs. So we're okay there. I'm going to try to avoid killing animals and stuff on the way. We still got a ton of meat. Like, we're just like ridiculous amounts of meat. So um, just to avoid picking up more stuff. And yeah, that'll be about it. And once we hopefully find this trader today, um, I'm really hoping we find the trader. Uh, then we can, um, oh, maybe it's on the other side of this town over here. Then we can at least know, oh God, it's going to take us forever to cross this desert. At least then we can know where um, we need to be um, for that survivor camp. It's tricky, like, like on this map, it's so big, but the survivor camp's kind of like middle bottom area ish. I gotta hold off getting any yucca right now. Just because we're moving so slow and it is, we are getting heated up pretty quick here. Hopefully, we don't get overheated. I think this is a big desert. Alright, we've been making our way through this desert town quite a ways. This is the first zombie we spotted. I'm kind of shocked. It's been really, really quiet today. I think we'd be able to smell the zombies before we'd be able to see them. Especially in this heat. Another one. So, we have the ability to make a bicycle now. So we need plastic. We need one more oil. Uh, and then, oh, I think I know where we are. Uh, we need plastic, we need one more oil, and then we'll need, um, I think that's it. We're going to need some more metal pipes, but those are relatively easy to get. I've been hanging on the ones that we have right now. I only have two, but still, I think I know where we are. So that is the wasteland biome, which means I think the trader is probably up over here. I don't know if we need to go through the wasteland to get there, though. I really hope we don't. Oh, yeah, we're, uh... I think definitely where we should be. I think... Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is it. We need to cross over that way. The trader's over that way. Now, I think this building might have I picked up a couple things as we were going to oh we got this I found a couple of things as we were walking along uh, some more jars and a, uh, a hoodie which is nice damn it we're really overloaded now uh, he says as he can't uh, you know stop picking shit up um, yeah so um was I saying? Oh yeah, I picked up the hoodie just in case we go through the snow biome. Be a little bit warmer wearing that. 
not much but a little bit yeah so I think the trader might be over here don't think so because I think it's he's between a mix of a snow biome No, I think we need to keep heading this way. Right. I think I remember where I am now. Have a quick look at the map. So, yeah, we come around here. We travel across this way. We hit a desert. Then we'll find him. I'm hoping. Yeah, there's the wasteland there. That continues along for quite a bit. So all we got to do is kind of like shadow the wasteland biome here and we should come across what we need. Without that trader we have no idea where that survivor camp is going to be. So we got to find him first. This is a big territory, this place. You know, I suppose if I, had pro if I did my normal priorities like I normally did, uh, which was uh, heading down the tech tree first. Um, then we may have um, had a bike by now. Which would make things so much easier. Okay, is that wasteland or burnt forest? It looks like burnt forest to me. In which case, we're off course. Which is not good. Yeah, I tried to ambush me, eh? Well, didn't work out. Nice. You know, I could be wrong. It could just be over here. I do kind of remember this. Yeah. I think we go this way. I think we hit up a desert. And once we hit the desert, we go until we find the wasteland biome. Follow that down, and then we can head across it. kind of know what it looks like, but I just got to get there first. All right, we're coming up on a corner of a snow biome and the burnt forest, and I don't know where I am. It's a very bad thing to not know where you are. So we may be wandering for a bit, which is going to be bad. We may just have to take a gamble at knowing where that uh, survivor camp is and just try and head there. I somehow think the trader's up there. We're gonna head that way. If this, I'll tell you what, we're gonna cross the snow biome freezing our ass, asteroids off. Actually, you know what, we're not. We're gonna head up this way in the burnt forest biome, flanking the snow biome, because the snow biome we're gonna freeze our ass off in. I don't think that sweater's gonna help one bit. Um, Well, it'll give us plus nine. I don't know if that'll be enough, though. Tell you what, let's put that on now. And then let's just try and go in. Because I do think the trader is up this way. I think. So that's a fire department, I think. Relying on your memory is not necessarily a good thing, since human memory is incredibly faulty. Unless, of course, you have a photographic memory, then maybe it's not that faulty. Yeah, see, we, we can't do this. It's going to just take us way too long. Let's get back into the burnt forest here. 
burnt forest biome is an interesting biome. The only thing I really encountered in the burnt forest are uh, crawlers, um, fire zombies, bears, and birds. Vultures, that is. But it's relatively quiet, but there's no place to live here. Like, you'd have to build your own home. You'd have to, I mean, every once in a while, you, while you'll find a POI, but you got to, like, take one of these places, which has got concrete foundation, and just build up one of those places. It's kind of neat. It's kind of really, like, into, like, a really unique kind of biome. I kind of like it. It's really dreary and dark at night, and the em burning embers everywhere is kind of neat. I mean, they would have burnt themselves out by now, considering how, the amount of times it rains out here, but... Uh, Still, it's a kind of unique idea for a biome. I kind of like it. Uh, let's just take this. Okay, what's up here? So this could be it, maybe? Because that looks like forested area. So if I follow what I think is what should be what, Where the forest biome and... No, this doesn't even look like it. Well, it might be. It might just be. You know, I could just look at the coordinates on the map and try and figure out where it is, but... What fun is that? Yeah, it could actually just be up here. He says semi-confidently, like he said every other time. Oh, we need coal. You know what? I wonder if we should... Um, let's grab some coal on the way. That's what, three? Uh, just because if we get lucky and find a car and get some oil, then... Um, We'll be able to make wheels for the bicycle. But we need 20 coal to be able to make those wheels. Oh, somebody left their purse out here. Okay, so there's the coal. Not like we can carry that anyway. Alright, let's pray that the trader is up here. Let us hope, let us pray. We're gonna freeze. Move fast, move fast. There's the desert. Okay, it could be it. I think this is it. He says, happily, maybe. My only problem is I don't know if we still need to cross the wasteland over here. Hope we don't. We got like no experience today. It's hoping for a couple of levels, but it's just not happening. There's been like really no zombies. I'm right here, buddy. Right here. Dun, 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 and thank you. I can't afford to miss. There we go. Well done, son. All right, let's pray. Let us pray. I don't think this is it, but it might be. It might yet be, Mr. Frodo. It might yet. Yeah, I don't see a wasteland there anywhere. The wasteland was supposed to continue on past the desert and trees. And that's just all snow. Well, it might be. The trader might be up here. Oh, there's a lake here. You know, in all the maps that I generate, I know it generates lakes and stuff, but um, I rarely ever see them. Like, this is the first time I think I've actually physically... Se well, that's not necessarily true. I've seen one before in passing. Alright. That's going to save a slot. 
Nice. Oh yeah, we're running way better now. Oh yeah. This is much better. Nope, I don't see it here anywhere. Damn it. We don't find that traitor, we're pooched. Oh wait, maybe. Is that it there? It is! I think, that looks like a flag to me. I could be wrong though. It does kind of look like a flag. Like right up, right there. Uh, I don't know. Not convinced it is. It's the trader in the uh, storage place. So that could be it. Oh, I think we made it. Yeah, there's the... Uh, yeah, there's the uh, whatever biome. The other one. I don't know why I'm sneaking. I'm thirsty, am I? Figures. Had to wait for me to be thirsty. Had to wait for me to be thirsty after I got water. Yeah, there we go. That's it. Nice. And it's only 11 o'clock in the morning, too. So let's go in. We'll sell some stuff. Um, then, I mean, we could go hit up some POIs. I know I said I wasn't going to be getting any more beef, but... Or pork, in this case. But I figure, I might as well... And I didn't even take a... Uh, I didn't. Well, that's fine. That's just all the uh, bones and stuff. We don't have room for any of that. You brought my arrow back. So nice. Thank you. And that's what your that's your reward. All right. Let's get over there. I mean, we could spend a night up in here. But it's 11:24. We might be able to push on. We'd be there before day 5. But it's pretty much going back the way we came, I think. Yeah, I can't take it all, but that's fine. That's fine. There he is. We got so much to sell. We got so much coin, too. Hopefully we can uh, get some modifiers for our stuff here. Like I, He's like right on the edge of the wasteland. There's the wasteland biome right there. And then right south of him is another wasteland biome. Okay, first things first. We'll sell stuff, then we'll go around and find out what he's got here. In terms of loot. We've always got a bit of loot here. Not all of them, but most of them have loot. Your money is welcome here. Yeah, that's what I thought you'd say. Alright, let's sell some stuff here. Finally. Okay, all of these can go. Uh, what else do we want to sell? Sledgehammer. Not really a big fan of sledgehammer, so we're going to sell that. Uh, what else do we have for sale? Let's just sell the sweatshirt. Um, what else do we want to sell here? I think that's it. Oh, wait, we got all these. Nice. We got 6,000 coins now. Scope we can't use yet. Okay, let's just move these up so we know what we got here. Okay, so we need plastic. We need pipes. Pipes we can get easily enough. Plastic's a little bit more difficult. I don't know if he's got plastic, though. Probably not. And there's an airdrop, of course. Foregrip. Proves aiming and aiming accuracy. I got a puffer coat, too. It might just be worth getting that. Oh, BDU bottoms. Yeah, that's nice. Lucky goggles. Okay. Uh, and that's the stuff we sold them. 
Got wood splitter. Not a whole lot though. All right, let's get these bottoms on. And we'll just put these on this counter. Here, you can have those, buddy. They're all yours. All right, so what do we want here? We got 5,900. Uh, modifiers. Four grip, weapon flashlight, and a helmet light. And any head armor. I don't have any head armor right now. Four grip. But then what is that used on? We don't have anything that can use this right now. Because of level, right? Most likely it'll be for things like shotguns and marksman rifles and SMGs and <sighs> should we just buy it though? So we have it? I mean wood splitter is a nice thing too, right? Or do we just save our money? Um, generator bank. At some point we'll be able to make that though, so it's not such a big deal. I mean, we'll be able to make the other stuff too, but we have to, like, we'll be able to make the uh, helmet light and foregrip too, but we have to find the, uh, the um, schematic for that, right? Um, maybe we just leave it as like this. Won't take anything else. Climber. Shotgun. Buy the shotgun. Level four. I take a level one. I don't really care about the level four. Ammo. Yeah. Well. All right. We're gonna go loot. Your, I mean, we're gonna go look around. I'll be right back. I'm not gonna loot your place because that would just be wrong. All right, let's have a look outside here. What do we got? Nothing. Yeah, some paper. It's sellable. It's so quiet here. Usually when you go to a trader, there's like... Zombies crawling, like clawing their way in here. Okay, let's take that. Let's get back inside. Hopefully we haven't let too many zombies in. Okay, what else do we got here? Oh, that's on the way, but you know what? That's like right in the center of the, uh, uh, the, the bad biome. We should probably just sell a bunch of those. Got a water bottle, we'll take it. Okay, we can make bandages out of those. Anything up here? Oh. And here. Okay, let's just scrap this. Scrap this. Really? Oh, for crying out loud, I can never hit these damn snakes. There we go. Sorry, man. I keep hitting your land. Apologize. All right. He's going to boot me out for doing that. Oh, two coins. Okay, so the... Yep, mixer. Oh, mixer works. And the still. Still works. Nice. Forge. Forge works. This is a good place. What about the workbench, though? Now there's this. Nothing in there. Oh, the workbench works. Okay, so. Map. Right click. Save waypoint. All right, we're going to use... Uh, let's use this. T hyphen all. So T for trader and all for everything that works. Nice. That's really awesome. Okay, we got a little bit more to sell them. And we'll ditch some stuff and we'll make our way out of here. It is 1354. We won't have time to make it all the way to the survivor camp today. But we'll get damn close. Uh, he's selling five for each of those. This. 
sell that. We need the nails. Sell these and ditch the rest. No sell price. No sell price. Uh, we need those. I can make those into... Uh, let's just sell what we can. That's all one. Fine. Much obliged, stranger. Yeah, you too. You enjoy the day, my friend. Alright, let's make these into bandages. And get the heck out of here. Alright, so we need to head south. There's two ways we can go. I should have bought the puffer coat. You know what, if I go buy this puffer coat, then like... Shortly afterwards, I'm going to find one. You know that, right? What's all this garbage, buddy? you got to clean this place up. Uh, okay. Puffer coat, where are you? Thank you, Survivor. Check back soon. I get new merchandise daily. Do you now? I guess swale. All right, keep the duster in case we're going across desert. All right. So... We got some speed back, which is nice again. So if we head straight south where that uh, crate is, problem is, is that that's where the horrible biome is. How far south is it? Yeah, it's like right in the middle of chaos. Chaos Central. Yeah. It's in the wastelands. Let's try and flank, see how close we can get to it. Maybe we try for it, I don't know. Like the chance of there being a beaker or an AK in there is gonna be pretty darn slim. And that's a pretty big biome. I mean, we could, I don't know. My fear is that we get part way in there and we get attacked by dogs and vultures and, and have an impossible time getting out. I really hate this biome. Oh yeah, you gotta watch out for landmines too, that's the other thing. Plenty of landmines in that biome. They look like hubcaps. And sometimes they're not. Sometimes they are actually hubcaps. Actually, it might not be that far in. Let's go along the edge here. Kind of an interesting place to put a house. Stop sign that says, stop, there's a bag here. Right there. Uh, wait, am I still wearing this thing? Really? I thought I had something better. Oh well. Page boy cap. Now I look like a page boy. Nice. Oh, it might not be in the, uh... No, it's in the biome. See, there's the desert over there. So we need to head south. Straight south. And that's where, uh... That is where... The, um... Survivor camp is. But can we get in there and get that? We might be able to. There's a desert over there, so we, like, it might not be that far in. If we run up as close as we can get to it, and then we sneak in there, we might be able to get it. What's up, buddy? Mono a mono. Oh, somebody's having a bad day. It ain't me, though. So far I'm having a good day. Of course that could all change real quick. Once I decide to go for this uh, loot chest and then get killed horribly. Alright, uh, we're going to put a marker on the map for working stiffs. Definitely want to come back here. Yeah, it's not that far. Um, Put a waypoint right here. Um, uh, 
tools uh, with a Z because it has to have a Z. Uh, okay, let's grab the uh, gas barrels and then we'll head over to the thing. Uh, you know what would be beautiful though? I think if we if it was easy to make like like really really easy to make gas in this game, you could just make a ton of gas barrels and then like just spread them around your horde base. And then as the horde attack, just like shoot them one at a time. Okay, there should be one over there too. Got one on the porch. And by the manure. Oh, experience. Sucks to be you. Okay, let's grab this. And then let's see what we can get. Don't know if we'll be pushing our luck here, but... I mean, we have to cross this biome. Oh, no, we don't. We're just going straight south. That's right. Not to cross anything. Okay, here's the edge. How far in is it? Not that far. Oh, I hear you. Got the pistol. I mean, we should be okay. Just want to avoid engaging with too much and making noise. I know you can see me. Stay over there. See? I think that's actually a hubcap though. It's hard, I think the landmines are smaller. But this is not a place you want to die by landmine. There you are. Beautiful girl. Hopefully. Oh my god, are you kidding me? We just picked up an AK and a beaker. Totally worth it. And I was going to leave it. It's all quiet too. Too quiet. Too quiet. All right, let's keep heading south. Should be okay now. We might actually be able to make it, well, it's seven o'clock, we got five hours. We might be able to make it to where we're going. Problem is, is if it's farther than I think it is, we may not. So I think we need to find a place to camp for the night. Yeah. Just trying to think if we wanted that or not. Not gonna sell it for much. What's the point? We've already got padded armor on anyway. Oh, green biome, okay. Alright, let's find a couple of small POIs that we can hit up while we're here. We'll make the remaining leg of the journey tomorrow. I was expecting to get there on day five anyway. So I mean, we're making good time. I was actually shocked that uh, we were able to find the trader today. I, did, I thought for sure I was completely lost and I wasn't going to be able to find him, but I'm kind of glad I went northeast. I wasn't sure that was the right move, but apparently it was, so... And now he's on the map. We can go back to him anytime we want. All right, let's find... Gotta find some kind of POI around here. I was hoping for more of those barns. Those are really easy to hit up. I don't see any, though. Plenty of places with plenty of time to be able to grab a place to stay. All we need really need is three hours to clear a place. Like a relatively small place, not a big one. Plus we got the AK. If we need to do it fast, we can sure as hell do it fast. Yeah, it's nice to have that though. I'm kind of shocked. I'm shocked at the beaker. That first series that we have though, 
Um, the actual, my inability to find a beaker. Um, I'm going to take that. Um, is definitely not indicative of this game. Because all the other kind of ones I played on the side, I, I'm not going to say it was easier to find beakers. It just wasn't like waiting to day 30 to be able to find a damn beaker. You know what I mean? Um, you know, you find them relatively simply. I find one in a medicine cabinet once. Um, you know, popping pills is obviously the best place to go. I found three in a popping pills once. I was like, what? How is this possible? I couldn't even get any in my other series. Oh, okay. Here's a place here. You know, I think we're actually a lot closer to that survivor base than I thought. I think it's just past these trees up here. Let's go look. And if it's not, we'll come back and clear a POI. But it'll be nice to get to a place where everybody's friendly. Uh, you know, I, I lost like my 12 friends crossing that uh, barren expanse. That was horrible, but it'd be nice to be able to see people again, finally. I mean, besides traders, those guys are just shrewd and they don't really care about you. Just the money. Um, they said it was by a shotgun messiah building, so... Just south of the shotgun messiah, they said. And is that what that is over there? Looks like it might be. Which means we're extremely close, and we got four hours to spare. Yeah, that's the Shotgun Messiah. Oh. I can taste the uh, excitement with people there now. Let's scrap the machete. Uh, let's actually just eat this. Level 2 compound bow in. Yeah, Shotgun Messiah. Alright, it's just south. Probably just past that tree line right there. Stay out of the cornfields. Every good horror movie. Stay out of the corn. Yeah, there's a hill. Probably just past that tree line. I feel like Gimli going to Moria. His cousin Balin. Give them a grand welcome. Malt beer. Meat off the bone. It'll be beautiful. Oh, they heard me walk by. They're a little angry. That's fine. I don't see anything though. Maybe there isn't any place down here. Oh. There it is, folks. I hope. We got some houses. Looks like a survivor camp. Yeah, there's a trader right there. Nice. I don't see anybody, though. Shouldn't there be people in the towers? Should be people in the towers, shouldn't there? I mean, it's awfully quiet. Um... That doesn't bode well. Let's go to the trader and find out what's going on. Huh. Should have taken that left at Albuquerque. No guards at the door? What's going on? Trader's open. Alright, let's see what he's got here. Okay, he's got it working still. That's nice. Yeah, that's working. The cement mixer's destroyed, though. Take the free stone. Thank you very much. And this is destroyed. <gasps> Let's go sell some stuff and come back and get those. Yeah, it's weird. There's, like, nobody there. I would have thought... Anyway. Oh, you're here. What's up, buddy? So it looks like uh, there was a uh, an outbreak and the zombies took everybody. Well, that's kind of shitty. I 
I guess all we can really do is try and rebuild. Pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, well, you too. Actually, I got some more stuff to sell you here. Peace um, be with you, my friend. The traders are just thinking about leaving, eh? There's, so there's three of them. There's one down there. There's one down there. They're thinking about leaving because they're pretty much all the survivors are gone. The camps here are dead. Well, that's kind of sucky. So now what do we do? I guess we try and rebuild, I guess. So let's attempt to do that. I mean, we can. Let's craft some steel arrows. Well, let's go across the street. We'll have to stay here tonight. We got two hours to clear this place. Let's not mess around. I saw a basement here. Okay, somebody down here. Anybody else? Ooh. Eight water, eh? Wow. I'll just drink that. There's another one over there, but we're not going to go after that one. We're going to go in here. We are overloaded, so we better be prepared. Be prepared to run in case there's a big fight here. Locked door, eh? So apparently the outbreak took all the survivors here. All it takes is for one person to get infected. And that's exactly what happened. Probably some stupid hunter that went out, got infected, didn't tell anybody he got hit. Came back, slowly changed into a Zamboni, and that was it. That's all it takes. Takes the one. Well, let me guess, is that a trap floor? Wake up. Okay, he's done. Trap floor. Trap floors are not anybody's friend. Oh, we got three. At least one is a slow mover. And one is a crawler. These all used to be survivors. I feel sad now. Let's drop some stuff off in here. Oh, we got a pistol. I'm gonna need that shovel. Put this in here. Where's my shovel? Take that. We're gonna have to sort this stuff out later. Ooh, we're gonna need this. All right, let's go clear out downstairs. Looks like this is where we're gonna be staying for a little while. Have to figure out what we're gonna do. We'll loot all the stuff in here. And I think tomorrow we're gonna need to head over to the uh, that camp next door and find out what went wrong. Uh, let's get a door. Get that into play here. All right. Pick this up. Nothing. Let's pick up all the trash. So if we're moving around in here, we're not making noise.
Okay. Less than an hour left. Let's go downstairs. And see what's in here. Oh, five more water. That's awesome. Okay, we're going to break up this. Then we're going to grab this cobblestone. We're going to break, like we're going to block up this uh, entranceway in the basement. We don't want anybody down here. Oh, before we forget, I'm going to need some fiber here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. Need three more. Let's grab a few extra like we always do. Just in case. Okay, so now we do... Uh, where are you here? Blackstone block. We need six. Block that up. Let's get the stone from down here. We could definitely use that. Okay, that's that taken care of. So, I mean, I guess we could use this as a mine. We're going to need to get some materials. So, this will be our mine down here, I'd imagine. Grab the rest of the stone. The beautiful thing about this place down here is it's hidden from zombie eyes. Although they can still hear us digging and stuff down here. Alright, let's go back up. And then we'll close this up. Do that. Clear this up. Is this, uh... Okay, this back door is locked, so we're going to grab this, and we'll fill this in. Oh wait, is there something down there? There is. Nice. Okay, let's repair this. Fill this in. Oop, not that. This. Let's break this out. And then we'll break the bottom two legs here, the ladder. Then tonight what I'll do is I'll set this place up to be defensible. If we get a random wandering horde that comes in here, breaks its way in, I'll set it up so it's defendable. Uh, we don't have to worry about them. I mean, they could still do a lot of damage from, to the building if I'm not careful, but we should be able to take care of it without too much of an issue. Uh, let's put these in here for now. Scrap that and scrap this. Okay, and what I'll do is I'll probably break into these things tonight as well. Um, and I will show you what's in them tomorrow. Uh, I'll loot the ammo pile right now, but uh, we'll show you what's in these things tomorrow. I'll probably, uh, I should have no problem breaking into this tonight because we're not going anywhere else. We don't have to worry about that. Oh, nice. Uh, so we'll get that done and get this all cleared up and set up and ready to go. And then when we come back next time, we're going to have to go in and find out what happened to that survivor camp. Uh, and maybe we take that place over as our main base. Um, but yeah, it's going to be a day at least to go in there and find out what's going on. It might take a little bit of time to fix it up. But then after that, we'll move in there and that'll be our base. All right, so I'm going to end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Also, you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, I'm sorry there's no, trader, there's no uh, people here, but uh, we'll see you next time.